Hey, hey guys. <laughs> Get away. You're so close. Why do you have to be so close to me? Once that was the scale who I'm tired of hey y'all. Hey y'all seems forced. I'm tired of seeing it actually. Um it's been a while. Did you miss me? Did you miss me? Um, probably not. <laughs> I see a lot of people on TikTok, hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all, and I'm like, dang. I thought it was, instead of saying, hi guys, hi guys, I didn't like that. And then I also watched the video years ago about pig eyes, pig eyes, pig eyes. Did you watch that? I don't know, did you? So, it's been a while since I've actually got to talk to you. It's, you know, I can't hear real good out of my ear. Um, so, how long has it been? Has it been a year? It's probably been over a year. Honestly, we went, where did we go for spring break last year? We went to do all the stuff in Tennessee and then the Walking Dead tour, stuff like that. I posted some and that's probably the last time I really posted anything other than a couple things here and there like birthdays and stuff. But I've just been in like the biggest funk ever. I don't want to do anything. My glasses are dirty and they're aggravating me because I can't keep them clean. I can't get them clean. I keep switching. Ugh. I have a headache. It's my sinuses. So, um, we're in Georgia. We've been in Georgia since like October. Um, I'm trying to see if you can see my eyes so it looks like I'm talking to you. Does that help? Does that help? <laughs> I don't know there might be a mess everywhere back here don't worry about it it's that you don't see nothing if there's a mess no there's not you don't see it so we moved to Georgia Tom got a different job we moved up here um has it been easy I mean for a while there no it was not and then I was contemplating hey was this the right decision? Should we have made this choice for the family and you know pull Garrett out of the other school? I don't even know if I made the video about the other school he went into after LCS kicked him out. Since that happened, I've kind of just been like, um, what is the word? Defeated, I guess. Like, I feel like our whole family just got punched in the gut. Both kids get kicked out. Amelia was able to finish the year. But you know how you go somewhere and you have just, you feel like you're not wanted? That's what you get. Um, so since then, it's just been, for me, I don't know so much about the kids. It's just been kind of like downhill. It sucks. I haven't wanted to do anything. I don't want to talk to anybody. I, honest to God, just want to sleep all day long. I don't want to see anybody. I don't want to do anything. I don't want to go anywhere. I want to watch TikTok and just sleep you know and then stay up till two in the morning get the kids to school and then come back home and sleep that's just what i feel like doing so i just feel like that was a big blow that you know the family took and i just haven't been able to recover from that personally me like i said um the city that we're living in we hate it <laughs> i hate it tom hates it the kids hate it um, when I was looking up schools, the school's like right around the corner from here. It takes us a minute to get there and it just has sucked. I'll have to tell you all about that another day. Um, I got sick in February. Uh, what happened? I don't like, I, you know, I always complain about like sinuses and headaches and stuff and I got I started getting a sore throat the night we went to pick my mom up from the train station because she came up to stay with us for a little while and I uh, had a sore throat, no big deal. The next day, you know, it was hurting and it was my sinuses and I kind of felt like, you know, how when you, you know, to pop your ears or whatever, I needed to do that really bad and I didn't really get it. So I laid over the edge of the bed and I tried to do it and all of a sudden I got like the worst amount of pressure in this ear 
so much pressure, so much pain. I just, I could not function and it gradually got worse throughout the night. So it ended up about two o'clock in the morning. I had to wake Tom up to um, take me to the ER to get, you know, stuff checked out and everything. And that was a whole fiasco. But I had really bad, really, really bad ear infection. And it is now, what month is this? May, the middle of May. And I'm still don't have full hearing in my ear. It's almost like if you go like this, kind of muffled where you can hear yourself but you're muffled and you don't know if you have to talk louder so you can hear yourself or if someone else can hear you and when I went to the doctor last week she checked my ears because I started to get a little bit of pain again in it and it's still been aggravating me since February and she said that my eardrum was like white that meant it was scarred and because my ear infection had been so bad I mean like we were I'll tell you a story and show you pictures on that another time, but it was it was bad and it was like leaking red, what I thought was blood, it wasn't blood, for 10 days straight it was disgusting. Um, so she said it may be like that forever. She gave me different drops because the drops that the ER had prescribed me made me have Bell's palsy in my face and I couldn't use this entire side of my face. And it was very hard to yell at the kids whenever only half of your face can work, you know, and very, very, very embarrassing going out to try to eat and you can't even open your mouth. It was, like I said, another story. Another day, another time. So, I'm dealing with that. The kids' last day of school is Friday. Today is Wednesday. Amelia had a an award ceremony today. Um, I'm just trying to update stuff. We we bought a house, so I'll probably I need I know I need to I need to I miss you. I miss talking to you. I miss letting you know what's happening. What's going on? I miss our talks. But we bought a house. It's about an hour away from here, but I'm just glad we're leaving this city because this city, everyone that we have had contact with at any place you go, you know, anywhere, to McDonald's, to the, um, where is it you go for, not DCF, wherever for like Medicaid, because I had to get that going with Garrett up here, and just everywhere you call or talk to, the people act like you are bothering them for doing their job. You go to a furniture store, you go anywhere to ask a question, and it's like they give you the most attitude for just them doing their job and you being there. We have three Walmarts, one Supercenter, two marketplaces, no Target. It sucks. No Sam's. It sucks. It sucks. The closest Sam's and Target are in Savannah, which is like 45 minutes for us. So I'm glad to be moving somewhere different, but just, just the city where the base, the army base, is literally half a mile up from our house. We hear the boom, boom all the time of the tanks and practicing tanks. The last few days it's been airplanes and stuff flying over, helicopters. It's just it's constant it's always this was not a good choice in area but we didn't know we had no idea so that's pretty much everything that's been happening I mean it's not really been exciting I've just been trying to survive and let the kids survive and it's been a hot mess because Amelia's like 15 year old you know fixing to turn nine next month and acting like a 15 year old I think we finally got Garrett situated with medicine and it's on to Amelia like I said that's everything is another story I just kind of wanted to update you and let you know I've been here and I see you I see you you know watching stuff and thank you we're here we're fixing to move but that's what's up nothing exciting I mean not really I guess I should start I would like to do daily things. I really want to start TikTok. Really? Because watching these people on there, I think that's what I used to do. I used to do that. Y'all remember my videos. Cleaning, doing this, doing that, daily things. And I'm like, these people, these people can do that. They're not any better than me at it. I can do that. I can go back and do that. It's just I don't have, 
I don't I don't have the energy to do it. I don't have the will to do it. I just can't get myself to do anything. It sucks. I don't know. So, I might leave you with a few pictures of stuff that's happening to maybe talk about another time. I may not. I don't know what's going to happen after I hit stop. Who knows? I may high five. I may high five you. High five. Oh my goodness. And I feel like we're gypsies where we move every single year. It's, it's ridiculous. But I'm hoping to be in a better headspace. I'm hoping to be in a better physical space. You know, a better space for the kids. And I just hope that you'll stick around for our journey. I know some of you have been here for a very long time. Since Amelia was a baby. A baby baby. I remember that when I was turning 30. And I just turned 38 last month. So... It's been a while. Some of y'all have been with me since then. So thank you. I appreciate you. And I see you. I really see you. I see you. I see you in there. Thank you. I appreciate you. Thank you for giving me an ear to listen. Thank you. You make me feel a little better. You're kind of like my therapy. You know, because when you when you feel like this, you don't want you don't want to deal with your friends. You don't want to talk to them. You don't want to deal with anybody. So I feel better talking to you about this. You might think I'm crazy. That's pretty cool, but whatever. So I will let you go, and I will get a hold of you soon to catch up a little bit more on stuff that's been going on. I'll have to check some of my videos, my last videos of what I was going to talk about or whatever, but. I know we have to talk about a move. I know we have to definitely talk about school because this school here, let me tell you, mm -mm, never send a child to this school. But we have learned. We live and we learn. And that's about it. So I will let you go. And thank you for watching. Stay tuned for new stuff happening. Possibly, hopefully, hopefully. And thank you. I appreciate you again. So have a good day and I will talk to you later. Bye.